everybody. Welcome to uh, week three uh, predictions for the Gunrunners. Uh, last week we went uh, ten and three in our predictions. We uh, lost the Axel Watt versus Farewell Foreskin, the Trash Gamers versus Bumble Sauce because of the forfeit, and Shoot Stoffel versus the One Hit Wonders. Pretty good record. Not too shabby. This week um, we're going to be playing on Barn Blitz. I'm streaming our scream that we did last night and um, bounce around from people's point of view. Uh, tonight we're only going to have five uh, people on the panel instead of the last seven from last uh, week and I'll introduce them all. We'll start with uh, Dran who was our cameraman, uh, cameraman last week, uh, our starting soldier. He'll be with us tonight. Hey, what's up? We have Rar Spoon, our starting pyro. Hey. Steel Python, our starting demo. What's up, guys? And Link. Two, one, <laughs> just Link. <laughs> just Link, who's our... You're just, you're just so polite, aren't you? I am. Who is our utility player? Backup. He's a jack of all trades. He's a jack of all trades. Hey, Master of none. Jack. And he's madly in love with me, but um, I'm not going to tell anybody about that. Anyway. I'm have... <laughs> Alright, um, I guess we'll, we'll just uh, hop right into it. With the first match, uh, be right back on installing versus Blunderful. Rarspoon, take us there. Um, well, be right back on installing actually surprised me. Uh, but even even so, Blunderful is still going to take this. Uh, Dran. Uh, Satan, useful toaster. Gotta go with Blunderful. Steel Python. BRBU has a strong team, but when it comes to Wonderful, they're just they're just too strong. We scrimmed them last week, we know what they have. I'm gonna go with Wonderful. And Link. Definitely Wonderful. Use a toaster. Best ever. Okay, I'm just going to kinda of sit back and I'll be tiebreakers. I won't put in my vote unless it's a two to two. Uh so Blunderful will be our official uh pick to beat B uh BRBU this week. And on to number two. Uh, uh, looking Hampson versus sexy ass gamers. Uh, Rarspoon, go. Well, looking has been off classing, but I think that they're still strong enough to beat uh, Sag. Uh, Jan. Yeah, I definitely have to go with looking, even with the off classing. They're just a group of really great players that they're just gonna overpower them. Still. I have to agree with the rest of the guys. Looking just has a strong team. And no matter what class, they have a lot of strength to them. Link. I know for a fact that that's actually them hardly off-classing, so I'm definitely going with looking. <laughs> so, uh, looking it is, our official uh, pick again. I uh, personally would have gone with SAG, but hey, I'm not voting. Uh, Tangerine versus team player, Rarspoon, go. Um, I didn't actually see t uh, team player play, but... I think Tangerine's got this one. They've got really great uh, players. Uh, Jan? I definitely have to go with team player on this one. With Puff at demo, this is a very demo-centric map in a lot of points. And I just think with Puff there, it's just it's going to be no contest. Steel. I don't know if I agree about that, but I know Tangerine had a rough start last season and kind of really pulled it up and pulled it together at the end, so... I think they're going to continue their role. Okay, and Link. All depends on if any of the invites are showing up. I'm definitely going to go with, with TP before invites, after invites, Tangerine. I'd have to uh, agree with uh, Link there. What does that leave us at? Yeah, but that doesn't help. It's got to be one or the other. Do you want a and definite with answer? With invites or without? <laughs> it is off season, so I'm going Tangerine. They have land later on, so. Alright, so Tangerine's our pick. Versus team player. Yeah, ammo. Next up is uh, Syndicate versus Axel Watts. Uh, Rarspoon? Uh, Syndicate is pretty stacked, but I don't, I don't know how much uh, experience they have playing with each other, whereas Axel Watts, they all play with each other all the time. So I'm going to have to give it to Axel Watt begrudgingly. Begrudgingly? What's up with that? Begrudgingly. Well, I mean, I'm just saying... 
Uh, not that I hate him or anything, or dislike him. I just... It's I would thing. like the Syndicate to win, but... Dran. This is one I have no idea. I mean, both teams have good players, so I'm just gonna flip a coin, and I'll just go with Axel, what? Steal. I don't know, I wanna go with the underdog here, although the last two guys just kind of defeated that purpose, but... Wait, who's the I'll underdog? I'll say Axel, what? I think Axel was probably the underdog on paper, but I think they could pull out a win. Link. The Syndicate, hands down. And I guess that makes me the tiebreaker? I I will go with the Syndicate as well. I'll probably pick this one as my match of the week, though. Um, Axel going two weeks in a row in my match of the week, but uh, I think this will be a great match. Uh, I'm going to have to go with the Syndicate, though. You do miss all fix, man. Whatever. Alright, uh, next, uh, Land Before Time versus Bonus. Uh, Red Spoon, go. Uh, well, Land Before Time was really, uh, pretty strong when we scrimmed him yesterday, but they had lots of subs, so I, I don't know exactly how well they would do on this map with all their starters. However, I'm going to give it to Bonus. Dren? Yeah, let's go with Bonus, too. I mean, Firefly is a good medic and putting cop and I think pyros are very strong in this map as well especially with that last point a pyro can definitely shut down that uber and make that last point really really difficult to push into still I think it'll be a close match but in the end probably bonus will take that and Drant or I'm sorry Link definitely gonna go with bonus snake kryptonite is the best Bonus it is, our official selection this week. And uh, we're going to hop right on over uh, our match versus Shoot Stoffel, which will be a fun and exciting match. And hop over to Stock for Pubs versus Trash Gamers. Rarspoon. Well, they both actually won by uh, forfeit, so I wouldn't know based on the record. However, Stock for Pubs does have more history, so I'm going to go with Stock for Pubs. And uh, Tran. Uh, S4P, their best player is their scout. I'm not sure how much a scout's gonna actually, like, matter on Barn Blitz. Uh, I don't know Team Trash Gamers at all, but, like, this is hard for me. I, I'm from S4P, so I gotta go with them, even though I don't know how much the scout's gonna matter, and he's their carry. Steal. I used to pub on Trash Gamers, I'm going to Trash Gamers. That's not You're so the server, I don't think. Cheap. That's okay. Just saying, I'm the best. Um, Link. Stock for pubs. Not, don't really know much about trash gamers. I pubbed in that server every once in a while, but definitely going with stock for pubs. All right, we'll make stock for pubs our uh, official selection. Ooh. Suck it. Um, Tint Team versus Farewell Foreskin. Rush boom. <laughs> Well, this is tough for me because I've been on both rosters and I hang out with both teams all the time. Um, but I do have to say, FFN is definitely a s fantastic on payload maps. They beat Ranch last season uh, completely out of nowhere. And I think Jake is... Jake! <laughs> so FFN uh, to Rarspoon, Dren. I was supposed to vote for a tin team to make fun of Moji. But I gotta go with uh, FFN here, and with Jake. I mean, it's a good sniper map. There's a lot of open lines, so. Steal. FFN, they live, they breathe payload, so it's just gonna be one of those matches. Link. Definitely FFN. There it is. Definitely FFN for our vote. And Deleterious Hoodlums versus Mumble Sauce. Bar spoon. Well, both of these teams were the ones that lost the forfeit. So, uh, I'm not sure if there's going to be another forfeit, but I'm going to have to go with Deleterious Hoodlums. Garrett's a pretty good demo. So who's going to forfeit first? <laughs> pretty much. Okay. DH uh, has more people on the roster. So I, think, I think DH is Less. probably going to probably gonna win, assuming that they actually play the match. Dren? Can I vote that it'll be a tie, 0-0? Zero, zero? <laughs> no. Uh, I, I have to go with Mumble Sauce. I guess they got an XTV member on their team. 
And steal. DH. Because they have more people on their roster. <laughs> and Lee. Very little show up. If Mumble Sauce shows up, definitely Mumble Sauce. I know most of them from sixes, and they're all really good players. If they show up. Which they will. I'll make sure. Wait, was Don't that worry. a tie? Is someone keeping track of that? Yeah, yeah that was a tie. tie. That was a tie, and you messed it up earlier, I think. The TS versus Axel what wasn't a tie, but whatever. You guys are supposed to be keep keeping track of this while I uh, do the camera. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah I, I think I, the, I think I the quote was it. I think the quote was don't worry somebody will fix uh, will realize it fixer I think that was the quote wasn't it? Sounds like hey, to me. I, I let Steel know that there was a tie or there wasn't a tie and he didn't say anything so I blame Steel. I just said lol. <laughs> okay. Can we just go on? Mumble Sauce will be my um, choice if uh, if they show up. It's transfer. One hit uh, oh, wonders versus um, IFA Omega uh, Respin. I think one hit wonders is gonna take this. IFA Omega is pretty good when we face them, but I, one hit wonders uh, roster looks kind of stacked. Why do you have that in your background? What is <laughs> my what is that? My freaking my freaking sister likes to watch TV with volume super high. What is she watching? Some kind of uh... some girly show or whatever. Oh, so that's your quote-unquote sister watching that. Yeah. Okay. He doesn't <laughs> have a sister. Yeah, that's what I thought. I thought he just had brothers. That's what he said. Uh, that's okay. Uh, nope. We, we all have uh, guilty pleasures. <laughs> Mine's Paramore. But not the show. All right. I, I'm not... So, uh, One Hit Wonders versus talking. Omega Dren. Uh, I have a personal vendetta against Cat because I hated my life playing against Cat in the last match, so I have to go with Omega. I mean, Cat's a really good pyro. Mike was a killer scout. He has to go up against Blaze, perhaps, which is going to be a little tough for him, but who knows? I got... <laughs> yeah, I guess I'll just... I gotta go with Omega. Steal. I'm gonna have to go with Omega. My friend is no longer on One Hit Wonders, so. I'm gonna have to go with Omega. Uh, Link. As much as I enjoyed playing Omega last time, I would definitely want to go with One Hit Wonders. Wait, is that another tie? Yes, yes it, it is. is. This one is a tie. You guys suck. You, <laughs> wow, thanks. And you blow, it's okay. <laughs> um, yeah, I like Omega. Cat was awesome. Mike was awesome. Uh, they both gave us a real hard time. Um. But if, if One Hit Wonders is fielding Blaze, I'm going to go with One Hit Wonders. Now make a them our official selection this week. And moving on, Baby Punchy Marathon and The Asylum, Marspin. I think The Asylum's got this. Uh, Baby Punchy Marathon has some really good players, and they've really put it like together since like last season. But Asylum looks pretty stacked with Pulse and Polk and DM4. Jen. Uh, BPM, I mean, it seems like their carry is bronze, which is again another scout, so I'm not sure how much they're actually going to do on Barn Blitz, so I I can't vote for BPM, I have to go with A9. Steal. I have to say A9, I know they're still learning how to play with each other, but I'm sure they'll pull it together for this match. And a poke on heavy. And a dog in the background. <laughs> That would be uh, Bentley, uh, Steel Python's dog. What kind of dog is it? It's a happy dog. I'm sure you're all dying to know. It's a happy dog. Okay, Link. Just because everyone else went with the Asylum, but no, seriously, BPM. It's just because they're playing longer. I mean, payload takes a lot more coordination than people think, so... Okay, that still makes Asylum our official selection. And next is Reddit West versus DMS. Rarespoon. Um, hmm, this is a tough one, but I'm gonna go with West. Alright, short and simple. To Dran. I, I gotta hope for a meteorite on this one, but I'll just go with West. Uh, Steel. I'm gonna have to go with uh, uh, Reddit West on this one. Link. 
Red at West, because Francis is awesome. Well, there you go, Red at West. Official selection to beat DMS. Next up, uh, Short Bus Commandos versus Team Bahana, uh, Banana Hammocks. Um, well, I didn't watch this, the stream, and I haven't watched the video on YouTube of uh, Looking versus Short Bus Commandos, so I don't know anything about Short Bus Commandos. But I was apparently informed that Double doesn't even know his team, or Double as, or whatever his name is. 007? Yeah. I, I, I prefer Double. I mean, that's what, uh, what's his name, Dino has always told me it is, so I'm going to Duel. Um, so I'm going to go with Short Bus Commandos. Okay, Dren. I've got no idea, so I'm just going to go with Team Banana Hammocks. Out of hunch. Steel. I don't really know either team, but Short Bus Commandos, I like their name better. Oh, for Pete's sake. Uh, <laughs> Link. Team Banana Hammocks, I know... Remo's good, and Eulogy is a great player and awesome person, so... That makes That's a tie, Victor. That's a tie. That's, That's a tie. tie. Another tie. Alright, I'm gonna go with uh, Banana Hammocks on that one. Make them our selection. And last... Because you thing. like them. I like Banana Hammocks. Yeah. You just like the Banana Hammocks. I like Fix's $5 hand jobs, but that's just me. <laughs> no more coupons for you. But I'm <laughs> There's still five bucks, so. Yeah, but Link had a 25% off coupon. Oh snap! Oh, yeah. Not anymore though. It's been uh, pulled. <laughs> no pun intended. Whatever. <laughs> Moving on. Uh, last bosses versus menace to society, who apparently has returned. Um, Rushman go. Um, I I don't know if Harbu plays. I would say menace society. Otherwise, the last bosses. So. It's off season, so I'm probably thinking Harbu's gonna play. So Menace is Society. Dran. Yeah, MCS. I mean, if Harbu is playing, which ESCA is not going on right this very second, so he probably will. So MCS. It's it's going on. It's just playoffs for every other team. Right. Like he's ones. not actively yeah. playing. Scrimming, yes, but not actively. Uh, Steve. If MTS doesn't disband before the match, then yeah, they'll win. <laughs> Link. Definitely going with MTS. And that would make um, our selection for this week, and I suppose that, that kind of does it. Um, We didn't really shoot for shorter or longer, we just played it by ear this week, I don't know. Let us uh, know how you guys uh, feel you want shorter or longer. Wait, wait, you wait, we didn't do match of the week. We have to do match of the week, don't we? Yeah. I skipped right over that. Rarspoon, your match of the week. Tin versus Frag, or uh, Farewell Force Tin. Why is that? Um, because I know both teams, and I've been on both the rosters, and I, I know that both teams have been getting used to uh, the season, growing pains with roster changes and whatnot. But uh, Tin team just got a new heavy. And they've been working pretty well together, and FFN is just really good on payload, so I think it's going to be close. Dren. I think it's pretty easy this week. There's a lot of 2-0s going to be going up, but I think Team Player versus Tangerine is probably going to be the closest. Still. I actually think it's going to be S4P and uh, Team Trash Gamers. They're both kind of teams pulling together, so it should be interesting. I think they're around the same level. And I think BFL and BRBU might be closer than some people think. Uh, Link. Uh, Tangerine versus TP. I think it's going to be really fun to watch. Really close. Personal one, though, Looking versus any team, because Looking is awesome. Hein is my favorite. I'll get your nose out yeah, of this butt. Aww, you're so cute when you're mad. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm a little beard. I'm gonna throw. What do you mean? What? My little beard. <laughs> <laughs> my beard was fucking epic. Was was. I yeah. will send that around to everyone. You wait. It's on my phone still. What is it doing on your phone? <laughs> it's worth gotta remember. It's a little. Creepy. Gotta remember the five dollar hand jobs. It's actually my background just because of how handsome you are. <laughs> That's awesome. Imagine it's your hand. <laughs> that puts everything in perspective, Link. 
pretty I know, much. It really does. Okay, well, uh, I'm going to throw in mine as well. I have a hard time choosing between Tangerine and Team Player and um, Bonus and Land Before Time. Um, ah, Syndicate X a lot would be great, too. I think there's a lot, a lot of good matchups. Um, uh, that being the case, I'm going to go with uh, Tangerine versus Team Player as my match of the week. I don't know. I think it'll be uh, an exciting game. I, I don't know who's going to come out ahead in that complete guess, but uh, I I'm going to decide with Team Player myself. Anyway, did we have? I guess we had two votes for that, so that wouldn't make it our official selection as a uh, match. Three, three. We Who had else? Three votes. Yeah. Link, me, and you. Oh yeah. Yep. Everyone but me. And Ron. And me. Yeah. You don't care. Yeah, I don't. Oh wow. I don't. I don't. I don't think um, um, doing the camera work and hosting is going to work for me. I'm not not many things work for you. Yeah. Is it too much? It's uh, too much, too much multitasking. Wait, are Can we you dead? walk and chew gum? I don't chew gum. Well, could you walk and chew gum if you chose to chew gum? I could try. That means you'll probably fail. Probably. Alright, anyways, um, everybody let us know um, what you like and what you don't so like. So we weren't done? That sounded like we were done. We're done! Okay. God. Did you just though, sign right? out? Well, you guys gotta stop messaging me because I didn't turn my um, messages <laughs> off, so I'm seeing it. Yeah. All right, Kermit. <laughs> hey, it's not easy being me. Not easy being a uh, muppet. Uh, 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 uh. All right, I'd like to thank uh, XTV uh, again for um, letting us do this and uh, getting our voices out there, and no matter how cracked up we may be. This is, uh, we're having a blast. And, uh, I'd like to thank EO Reality. Uh, you can go to their, uh, get TF2 servers from them at eoreality.net. Use the code XTV for, is it 15% off? For life. For life. Not just for the first year, for life. Hit them up if you're looking for a server, and we'd appreciate it.